Yeah, my name is Karim Makhlouf. I'm Chief Commercial Officer of Galfair. Thank you for talking to Breaking Travel News. Uh, could you just talk a little bit briefly about Gulf Air, uh, the markets that you cover, the size of your airline? Yeah, obviously Gulf Air is somehow the pioneer of flying here in, in the Gulf and in the Middle East, being 62 years uh, old. Um, we are offering the biggest network here in the region, um, covering most uh, destinations here in the region and expanding as well further. Uh, recently with regional aircraft in order to increase frequency and offer a, a multi-daily product to the main capitals here in the GCC and the Middle East. So you're a dominant, dominant airline in the region? <laughs> well, in terms of network, yeah, we want to make flying a commodity, especially within the region, and connecting as well the region, the Gulf and the Middle East, uh, the best towards Europe, Africa and, uh, and Indian Sub and Asia. Here we are in Abu Dhabi at the ACO AGM. How important is it for you to be part of a forum such as this? Well, it's a great forum. It's a great opportunity to network as well with other colleagues from, from other airlines and to discuss the common challenges we are all facing. Obviously, economy, unfortunately, is, is cooling down. Uh, fuel costs still on, on, on high levels. And it's, it's good to exchange, to exchange the, the challenges of the industry with different uh, colleagues here of different airlines in the region. And with so many Arab airlines in one room, how does Gulf Air differentiate itself from your regional competitors? Well, first of all, of course, this region is the, the power engine of the global aviation with growth rates of 17%, as, as we saw in the presentations. Um, obviously, we try to diversify from other leading carriers here in the region by offering a more moderate growth with a more regional focused strategy, occupying niche markets and having a, a constant but moderate uh, growth. And as well, investing a lot into regional aircraft, which is different to our main uh, neighboring airlines here in the region. And just lastly, how do you see the future growth for Gulf Air? Well, we plan a steady growth of about 5 to 10 percent uh, a year. And uh, as I said, we, we want to make flying a commodity for the people living here in the region and offer multi-daily uh, flights to connect the centers in the Middle East and in the Gulf um, in order to have the best connectivity here within the region rather than focusing on uh, connecting globally the centers. Wish you every success and thank you for talking to Breaking Travel News. Thank you very much.